Hello everybody, I am Whitney Mosquera and this is my daddy. I am Wellington Mosquera. And we are going to show you how to make a delicious pudding. Um, where is this pudding from? Colombia. It's from Colombia. And what is the name of the pudding that we are going to prepare today? I said that. What's the name? <laughs> Natilla. It's Natilla. Okay, so if you want to learn how to prepare this delicious pudding, just come with us. Come with us. Okay, everybody, what you will need is milk and cornstarch and cinnamon. And you'll need one coconut and sugar. <laughs> now the next thing that we need to do, Whitney, is to grate the coconut. Mm -hmm. And preferably we do it with a spoon so yeah. that we can when we are scraping scraping we, this coconut. We can get it in little flakes. Yes, yeah, we can get it in flakes. So we cut the coconut already and then this is what you are going to be doing. Scrape it like this. Whoa, that's strong. Yes, so we can get the, 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 the coconut in flakes like this. <laughs> so exactly, will come in flakes like this. And uh, we are not going to get any of that black um, part in the coconut. So, this I guess is the longest part, alright? Really long. It can take extremely long. Especially now, it's night. Yeah, so what we are going to do is just... Um, Put some... Do, do this part and then when we finish, we come back and show you the rest of the process. Alright? So Whitney, we have a lot of work to do, alright? Yep. <laughs> All right, all right, and uh, now we have finished <laughs> scraping the coconut. Mm -hmm. We finished with this shell. Shell, shell, one right, big you can shell. See empty, Ew. and we have all the coconut in here. You can see. So we are now ready to cook to prepare the natilla. But wait, what? We forgot to do something. What is that? We need a pot. A pot? Oh, yeah! We need, we forgot the pot. <laughs> What's that good thing? Well, we have here... A pot. A pot. Yeah. And, okay, so we have all the ingredients now. Let me see, turn a little bit. Let's, let's huh? then to show. We have the milk. Really? We have the milk. Are we putting the milk now? Yeah. This is the key ingredient, is the cornstarch. Corn corn Any brand that you can find, but once it's cornstarch, that's okay. Yep. So this is practically the most important ingredient here, right? But if you use something else, it won't taste right. good. And we need cinnamon. The cinnamon. Uh -huh. the milk. Island spice we cinnamon have, powder. We, <laughs> we have here the coconut. And uh, the sugar, we sugar. Have there. Now we have the pot as well. Yep. A good size um, pot. And you forgot. What I forgot now? Daddy, the same thing. The pot. The pot. Oh, and something as well that we forgot to mention, and we have it here. Some raisins. Some. Now I forgot something. All right, some raisins as, as well that we need. So. Right there, we need some raisins. Right here. Any kind of raisin that you want to put in there. Any right? kind. <laughs> the big Even one, the small ones, any one. Any. Right. So what we are going to do Daddy, now. Daddy, how does Nadia taste with apple? <laughs> <laughs> All right, what we are going to do is get in the pot and Coconut. we are going to put the milk. milk in there. Can I do it? Yeah, so. But wait, we need, you are giving your back to the, to the public. So we need to show them. What How we, we do it? What we are doing. Okay, right. so, so we're going to pour the milk. Yes, yeah, so wait um, a moment. We are going to pour the milk now. 
All right, we are going to pour the, the milk in the pot. Let me open Ooh. it for you. Okay. Ah. Like that? Yes, pour all some of it. Some water in there. All of it. Everything Something in, for, in, in the bottle. Know. Something, everything in the bottle? Everything. Eh, 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 eh. So something important here to know is that we are not going to use water, all right? Only milk. So it's just the milk that we are going to be using. All right? We are finished with this. Wow. Let's see. A lot of milk. <laughs> All the milk. So we have used one one liter of milk. And this one, this has one liter. Yeah. One liter. So that means that we are not going to make a lot of natilla. But we're uh, making it. Alright. This is the milk. Mm. This is the full cream milk. Because this needs to get thick. Um. So something that we are going to do now is to put this milk on the fire and allow it to start boiling so let's do yep. that okay everybody now for this part i need help from my daddy because i have to put the pot on the stove which is dangerous for children Okay, Winnie, then let me help you. Whoa! So you move there. And we are going to put the pot with the milk. We are going to put it on the stove. And we are going to wait until it starts um, almost boiling. So when it when it's starts boiling, we are going to put the flame in low. Right? Daddy! Um... Something um, we have to do here when we put the milk is now we are going to add the cinnamon so that the, the flavor practically get, get into that milk. So we are going to need to put the cinnamon. Um, we are going to get a spoon as well to mix this. Remember this is milk, so we had to keep an eye on it because easily it will start now raising, you know, so we have to keep an eye. I'm going to just teach you here a, a, a little trick for the milk because you know that when milk starts boiling, usually it starts going up. So for that, find a spoon one of these uh, wood spoon and you just put it here in the middle preferably one that is bent like this a little bit so you put it here in the middle when the milk start raising it will touch this and then it's not going to overflow right so that's a little trick so let's wait until that um this thing start start boiling and then we continue from there now this is almost going to boil so it's time for us to add the sugar I don't usually like it very sweet so I'm just going to add about two spoons of sugar don't like it too sweet and uh, then we mix it. This is almost going to boil now. You probably are, ask, you are going to ask me how long it will take. Well, it's not going to take more than 20 minutes to, for this to be ready. This is something that is really fast. You know that milk usually boils fast. So this part is not, not really hard. So once we have this and we have tasted that um, the sugar is okay for us, the level of sugar, then 
I think we are ready. Let me put one more. Half a spoon. So that is not very sweet, but you will put the, the sugar just to your taste. Now something else we are going to add, and I'm going to wait for Whitney to come, is the coconut. So I'm sure that she wants to help us. This is starting to boil. So I'm going to show you this part. Well, Whitney, can you please give me the coconut? We need it now. Okay. Thank you. So here we have the coconut. Mm -hmm. See how the pot is starting to come now up. So I'm just going to put this coconut so it can get some of the coconut flavor. I'm thinking about if we should put all this coconut or not. But it's something that you can just decide, you can put it to your teeth, alright? Mix it. We want it very yummy, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we are going to do it this way. Okay, um, uh, let's put a little more coconut. Yeah. Is it ready? Okay, so let's keep this and keep an eye on, on it. Because once it's are boiling now, we are going to put the other corn ingredient. Starch. And it's the cornstarch. Corn starch. Alright? Now we need the key ingredient here, the cornstarch. We are going to need another cup to mix it, to dilute this one. And uh, we don't want to put water in there because nowadays the milk already has water, so it's going to take longer to take. So I'm going to mix this one in milk. I'm not going to use water. So this cannot be with hot water, right? So, or milk. So we are going to do it. I'm going to open another box of milk. Just put more milk in there and mix this one. Right, that's what we are going to do. Now we're going to mix the cornstarch. Ooh. As we mentioned, we are going to do it in milk. So the cornstarch is just like flour, right? Yeah, just like a little kind of powder made of corn. It's made from corn. So the more you put, the quicker this thing will get um, thicker, like a pudding. <laughs> it's going to get hard. Pudding. So I am going to put Daddy, remember, practically, yeah. Remember, Natia, in Colombia they make it a little yellowish, but ours it's like completely white. Oh yes, that's that's the thing. Because in Colombia there is an ingredient called panela. It's it's like a, it's like the sugar, but the, let me see if we have a piece in here to show you. We don't have any, do we? Yes, we have oh. a piece in here. It's like it's panela. like it's like the sugar, but it comes in a bar. Ooh, so we still candy. have a piece. We still have a piece that um, we carry from Colombia from long, time long time. Ago. We still have it in the fridge. Let me show you here quickly. So we can't put it in the natia. All right. So it's here. Um, it's called panela. Panela. All right, let me see if we can get it. Yeah, Daddy. this one. It's called panela. We have only a little piece, but it's the, the sugar um, made from the from the sugar cane. And uh, this one, this one is what gives that brownish color. But because we don't have that one, then that's why we have to make it with sugar. And uh, it's going to be looking practically white. But we are using here brown sugar, all right? So, Let's continue with our process. So, show you how much I put. Put this, but probably need to put a little more. I wanted to more? to get very thick. <laughs> yeah. So here we are. Daddy, right. daddy. Let's what are we doing next? Next. 
we are going to put some milk here. Milk? To dissolve this. So <laughs> just put some milk in there. Do it. Put some milk? Yes, put some milk. And just in, mean, some. in the meantime, we have the pot. Oh, it's leaking. We have the pot um, here still at a low flame. Daddy, Daddy, what look, it's oh, it leaking. leaking. Oh, sorry, let me pour it. <laughs> yes, and the reason why I said we need to um. to mix this thing in in milk is because if we put water there, we already know. And it won't taste good. Yes, yeah, we already know that the the milk they are putting a lot of water in there, so it's not going to be so creamy, and it's not going to allow our pudding to get really hard. And so delicious. we better mix it. Let me mix this. This need to be mixed fast. All right. Okay. Ooh, some more coconut. Yeah, we still have coconut in there. <laughs> so let's mix it. We cut a lot. Remember of how coconut. important is that you just do it with um, room temperature milk or yeah, don't do it with anything hot because anything that is hot will immediately make this cornstarch get thick yeah and right. then it will be too hard and it won't yeah. have the flavor anymore mm. so we are mixing it it's almost diluted mm. and what are we doing after this after this we are going to put it on in, the fire in, yeah in the pot that we have there mm -hmm. with the milk and it will look even more delicious it will be even more delicious yes uh, So yes, now let me turn back the flame to high. So by now our coconut probably got a little more it's getting here, it's melting with the <laughs> the Corn. milk and the mm. cinnamon, so Ooh. it's getting the flavor. Mm. <laughs> Remember that people who cook have to taste what they're cooking. Yeah, but we already know we are expert chef. Chefs. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so. But Nunatia isn't weird. Yes, and it's very delicious, right? Yeah. Mm. We even have it in Christmas time. Yes, usually Natilla, yes, usually Natilla is in Christmas time that um, people consume it in Colombia. Let's cover this milk again. Mm -hmm. We don't want flies to drink mm -hmm. it. Yes, it's boiling again, so now we are going to pour this the milk and cornstarch. The cornstarch. Now, at this stage, you need to pay special attention because once you pour this, you need to start to keep mixing and mixing because this is going to get hard and mm. you have to pay attention that Daddy. it's is not going to... You have to be mixing because it can get stuck at the bottom of the pot, right? So it's already already <laughs> hard. We put a lot of starch. So it's getting really, really, really hard. But so let's put less so fire. So when we finish, it's going to be really, really tough. Well, I think we put too much starch. Yeah, too much, too much. But it will still be delicious. Even though it's All right, so let's tough. put a little more um, milk. I think it has too milk? much starch. Okay, let's put some milk in it. Come on, Daddy. So just Get keep the, milk. Keep the, fl the fire uh, low. Let me put a little more. And start mixing. And mixing. Remember at this stage, you have to be mixing and mixing and, and mixing. mixing. So let until me it gets so delicious. <laughs> and it's getting really tough. I guess Let me turn we turn the put camera too to much. you. One moment. Yes, now you have a closer look. You move the camera. It's getting thicker and thicker. As you can see here. <laughs> thicker and thicker. It and almost looks like porridge. Yes, but we have to keep it at low flame because. We don't want it to get to talk. Yes, it gets talk really quick. So really fast. Just keep mixing 
on. Keep to, using the spoon all the way to the bottom. So it doesn't get so tough, tough. Yeah. And then we have to allow this in low flame. Just keep mixing until probably let's give it eight more minutes. Probably eight more minutes until the cornstarch start cooking a little bit. Okay, we? Okay. It's about eight minutes that you will give it. All right. Just mixing and mixing and mixing. Oh, the flame is, is, is low in here. We have it low. Let's put a little more. Mm -hmm. So you can go. <laughs> All right. Ooh. <laughs> it's looking good. It's, it's looking so ticky because we put a lot of coconut. Oh, we need the, the raisins. The raisins, I forgot. We are forgetting the raisins. Please open the bag. Woo! It got a lot of milk on the bag. It's leaking. Yeah. Let's put the raisin quick, quick, quick. So let's put these raisins really quick. Yeah. We don't want to miss them. Right, Whoa. Let's... That looks delicious. Whoa. <laughs> You're putting a lot of raisins in there, All Daddy. Right. Get that one. Yep. And, and now it has a lot of raisins too. Yep. <laughs> let's mix then. Keep mixing. Daddy, let's don't, show them don't, what it don't, looks like. Don't um, get distracted because in one minute that you get distracted, it will me, come it will up. burn at the bottom of the pot. All right. And when you think it's ready, it will taste really bad at the bottom. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. Just keep mixing and mixing. We need to have ready some containers where we are going to put this because once we pour it in there and it start cooling down, it's going to get really hard. Really right? hard. So we needed the containers. We need to look for the glass ones. The glass, glass containers? containers. There are uh, glass containers. All right, after 10 minutes that we have been here mixing, and now this is consistent, there is no grooms in there, all those. Yes, it's consistent that you can put the spoon and practically <laughs> it falls. <laughs> stays there. Then you know that it's almost time to take it down from the taking off from the flame. So we already have prepared some molds, um, some containers where we are going to pour the natilla and, and that's the final one so that's the the shape that we want to give and um, let's show those ones okay everyone these things are the balls we're going to use to put the natilla in they're really fragile so we are taking this from the fire as well. So it's time for me to take um, the pot from here. So it's very hot. So yeah. With me, I'm coming. <laughs> I'm coming now. So let's let's start pouring there. Start from the from the big one. Remember that once that this thing start cooling down, is going to get really thick. Gooey, gooey. So let's put in this one first. Boy. Is it hot? It's a little hot. So let's <laughs> give it quick uh, here the, the shape because that's how it's going to be. It looks delicious. <laughs> Alright, we are not going to put this one to the top, alright? We are going to use another one from here. Let's put more in this one. Yeah. Um, still hot. Did you know you have to be careful with the tiniest? Yeah. So let's put more in this one. That's a lot. That's too much. That's too much. So that's the second one. We're going to get them. And this is the third. And we will just do this so that it can... This is the 
be smooth and all the, uh, the sides are going to be consistent. It's going to be delicious because we put a lot of coconut in there and remember anything with coconut tastes good. Alright, let's put this other container. It's the third container. This is the third one, yes. And this is the fourth one that we're going to do next. <laughs> Tomorrow, the natia will be done. Yes, after this we have to wait, just leave it there to cool down. So. We are preparing this at night. Yeah. And we are going to wait until the morning until it's completely uh, cold. So it's going to be really hard. So next thing we will show you is in the morning how really it is. We don't have a lot here we need, so we are going to just pour it in that container, all right? The the rest that we have here. Here. So let's not use that one. Why? Let's put, because there is not too much. So let's put it in this one. Please. Look. I want to have a lot. No, look. Oh, so let's done. put it in here, right? It's almost finished. So let's so, put it in this one. One for you, one for me. Uh, one <laughs> for you, one for mommy, one for me. <laughs> <laughs> you already made the decision. Distribution. Because <laughs> <laughs> okay, this one is the biggest. This. This one is medium, this one is large, and this one is tiny. Hmm. All right. Now... It's already getting getting hard. And now we need to put uh, on the covers now. Wait, wait, wait. Let's, but no, I don't know how to use these covers. No, let's not put it yet. Allow them to cool down, all right? Okay, so put them a little and then we put the covers. Let's leave them cool down and then after we put the covers, all right? Okay. So we are done with this. Look how the pot <laughs> is. We practically finished. So now that we're done with the nafia. What are what is next? We would like to say goodbye. Yeah, but um we have to show we are going to show you. Um, because we have to wait until tomorrow Ooh. but this actually cool down it's already getting hard because we put, we put a lot of cornstarch corn so it's, it's getting hard really quick once it's starting to cool down yeah but we are going to wait until tomorrow because especially we prepare this for who my mommy yes we prepare it for her we want to give her a surprise and tomorrow tomorrow we are going to have a surprise for her just decorate it and and give her some delicious pudding call yeah but remember your other idea yeah so um just at the end we show you we will show you the results how is in the morning but for now we tell you thank you very much for spending the time with us learning about this if you knew it already um, there are different ways to prepare this we just prepare it with the ingredients that we have here so remember to like the like videos and love and comment and so, most of all what we ask you to subscribe yeah to subscribe to our channel so that you can uh, watch more 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 because we are going to be having more and more videos for you, okay? So remember, subscribe. And like, and do everything you want to show you love our videos. <laughs> yes, yes. All right, so. Bye. We are the chef. <laughs> All right, bye-bye. See you next morning. Okay, now. Finally, the morning is here. Now our natia is ready. And we're going to show you how it looks. We're going to put it in a plate. You have to turn it upside down to get it out. And it's going to come out. But that part is really hard. Remember, we put a lot of cornstarch so it's going to stick inside. 
Ooh. Ah, and that's how it looks. Mm, just like a big pudding. Smells nice, huh? It looks like one big cake. <laughs> Doesn't it look amazing? Mmm. And you can see those little raisins. We are going to taste it now. Going to look for something to use. But we have to cut it in pieces. <laughs> Smells delicious. Ooh, Daddy, Mommy is supposed to cut it. It's her birthday. This is delicious. We had a lot of hard work today. I mean yesterday. Bye bye. Remember to subscribe. <laughs>